What's up, Bomb Squad? It's your girl, Pink Bombshell, a.k.a. Shell Alexis, and welcome to day eight of 31 Days of Halloween. Today, we are becoming Scar from The Lion King. So if you're interested in seeing how we got this look, stay tuned. As usual, we're going to start off by finding some references off of Pinterest. Again, we're not using any of these exactly. We're just kind of using them as a basis to get some ideas and see what we can come up with. Starting with the Elmer's glue stick, we're just gonna stick our eyebrows down. And once that dries, we're gonna go in with our concealer and we're gonna pretty much just stick that all over our face. And then we're gonna blend that out. Once we got that blended, we're gonna take our wet and wild paint pot and we're gonna put that all around our lips from about our nose area, mid nose area to under our chin. And then we're gonna take some setting powder and set our entire face. Next, we're gonna take my favorite palette, the Love Lex Luxury Palette, and we're gonna go in and kind of make Scar's hairline. It's like a triangle in the middle of his forehead that kind of comes up and, and curves on both sides. I don't know, it's hard to explain. It's, you can see it though. Now we're gonna sketch out our eyebrows, but remembering to leave a like a dash on our left eyebrow where Scar's scar is gonna go. Then you're gonna just fill those in. Now I'm not gonna lie y'all, it took me a while to get these eyebrows to a place where I was not even satisfied because I was never completely satisfied with them, but to a place where I could just move on. So now you see me going back in with the concealer and then setting it again. Y'all, I left that in to show y'all. It doesn't always work out the first time, but you can always go back and, well, I ain't gonna lie, you can't always go back and fix it. But a lot of times you can do things to kind of fix it and make it a little more like how you intended it to look. So here I am still working on these eyebrows, just going in with my concealer to cover up whatever I was not happy with. Yeah, I look goofy. That's why I'm laughing. Now we're gonna go in with the brown from our Love Lex Luxury Palette. And we're gonna put that all up in our eye, all up in our eye. <laughs> and then we're gonna take the black and we're gonna kind of go into our crease. We're also gonna use that up under our eye as well to just give like a smoky eye. I always say smoky eye, y'all. I, I don't know. Y'all know I'm not a makeup artist. I don't know words for real. I just be saying stuff. So just, just watch what I do. Don't listen to what I say because I do not know what I'm talking about. But we're gonna go ahead and repeat that on the other eye so they both match. Then we're gonna take a little bit of that black and go down our nose just to give it a little definition. And then we're gonna put it on the tip of our nose as well as on the sides of our nostrils. Then we're gonna go into some brown and kind of outline that mouthpiece. And I'm taking brown and using it almost like a um, bronzer or a, um, not a bronzer, a contour. And then I'm taking that black and kind of, I'm still just shading y'all. Ultimately, that's all I'm doing. Now I'm gonna take that black and add me some whiskers on both sides. And then I'm gonna take that black also and do my top lip. I'm gonna outline my top lip and fill it in, but I'm only gonna outline my bottom lip in black because I'm gonna go back in with brown and fill my lip in. Now, as y'all can see, we still gotta do our scar. So we're gonna take our white Wet n Wild paint palette and we're gonna, oh, we also doing eyeshadow too, can't forget that. So we're gonna use yellow and orange and we're gonna put that yellow just right on the tip of our eyelids and then we're gonna use that orange to kind of blend that yellow with that black. It's not gonna be a perfect blend, but you just wanna be able to see the, both of those colors, like a small little gradient on your eyebrow. I'm not your eyebrow, Lord, y'all know what I'm talking about. Now we're gonna go into our Wet n Wild paint pot and make where our scar is. We wanna make that white first and then go in with some pink. Now I'm kinda of making like a shadow effect with the black pigment. Going in and adding a wing to my eyes with this liquid eyeliner. And I'm also gonna take some of that black pigment and blend my hairline out to my natural hairline. 
add the lashes and then i got the bright idea to add glitter everything is better with glitter so i added the glitter right up under my brow line and this is the look essentially but you know the look is not complete without the wig she's giving fierce she's giving everything i am obsessed with this look this is my favorite one yet thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next video